Hello everybody and welcome to Tech in 5 Minutes. Today we are talking about Python and Node.js. Watch this video to learn their pros and cons, and which of them you should choose for your project. On our channel, we share thoughts on recent developments in the tech industry. Subscribe not to miss new videos. What are the criteria for choosing between Node.js and Python? Well, when we choose the tech stack for our clients, we at Jelvix usually focus on the criteria as what kind of project are we dealing with? What kind of product do we expect to deliver? What is the project's reach? What resources do we currently have? What is the situation on the market? What are our main performance criteria? Keep watching to know about the advantages, drawbacks, characteristics, and use cases of Python and Node. Let's start with Python. It is an object-oriented, dynamic language known for its simple, organized syntax and universality. Python is the most popular programming language in 2020, and it's used by 30% of developers. What are the advantages of Python? Well, among the reasons why Python is a go-to primary language for many developers, business owners, and employees, we define fast development and deployment, which allows developers to write complicated code quickly. Simple syntax that provides describing complex concepts in a few code lines. A large ecosystem. It is the result of Python's ability to respond to multiple development challenges. Among the most popular packages in a Python ecosystem, we name machine learning and deep learning resources, which includes libraries like Scikit-Learn, Torch, and TensorFlow. Language processing, which has NLTK and GenSim, and web development, which includes frameworks like Django and Flask. And the last point is a large community. It might seem like an insignificant advantage at first, but we actually found that having a strong community makes professional growth and experience exchange easier. What else could influence professional development? Drop a comment and share what you think. What are the disadvantages of Python? The first is a lower performance speed. Python is great at handling intensive operations, but they take more time to process. If you need to run multiple concurrent requests, Node.js is a better option. The second drawback is low performance quality in mobile versions. Here, the low speed performance question is even more of a problem than on desktop. And another problem with adapting Python code to mobile is that it doesn't mix well with native components. It's time to review Node.js. Actually, it is a runtime environment that's based on a JavaScript language. Node.js is the most popular development framework worldwide, and about 53% of all developers use it for their projects. So, what are the advantages of Node.js? The first is fast performance. It is the result of the non-blocking input and output. The second benefits is full-stack development, which became a popular trend. Many enterprises switch to Node.js to use JavaScript both on the front end and the back end. It provides better mutual understanding in the development team, saving time and resources by reusing code, and access to a large talent pool. The third pro is that Node.js is great for microservice development. Well, its ecosystem has many NPM packages that make it easier to modularize their architecture and migrate from monoliths. Here, we'd like to recommend our blog post on the best Node.js frameworks. Find the link in the description box. What are the disadvantages of Node.js? Node.js is poor at processing large data volumes because it uses a single thread event loop to process requests. If it's a computation, Node.js will take a while to get the result. The thread will be blocked and other operations won't go through. The other reason is a Node.js versus JavaScript problem. JavaScript is essentially a front-end language that contributes to Node.js low CPU handling capacities. It doesn't communicate as smoothly with the hardware and processing units. Messy syntax is the second disadvantage. Well, Node.js has multiple inconsistent models, often lacks semantic standardization, and is subject to frequent changes. Let's reveal use cases of Python and Node.js. Once we look at top websites, Node.js becomes a leader because it fits well with the needs of large companies. 
Among Python use cases are data science, web development of complex platforms, 2D and 3D GUI, scientific software, scrapers and parsing software, and testing and development. And Node.js is used for streaming applications, collaboration platforms, single-page applications, real-time messengers, and enterprise applications. So, both Node.js and Python offer excellent possibilities to development teams. So, the final choice depends on the characteristics of your project. This video was prepared by the Jelvix team. We provide software development, UI UX design, and testing services to top brands worldwide. Find our contact details in the description box. Thank you for watching this video. We share our experience in back-end development here as well. So make sure to subscribe not to miss a single video. And don't forget to like this video and hit the bell button. Bye for now.